there, it's me, Sandy, and uh, I'm super excited right now because I have a fragrance to try, and I'm gonna try it with you um, for the first time. And um, I got this like a week ago, and it's been sitting in its package from the mailing the whole time because I was looking for the perfect moment and all this stuff, and I wanted to do like a first impressions kind of thing with with my son or my husband, I had this whole elaborate thing. I'm like, oh, forget it. We can never mesh our schedules. So um, this is from Commodity. Commodity. That's very shiny. It's the, I can't read it backwards, the Scent Space Expressive. So if you've looked into Commodity at all, you know that they were a brand and then they folded and then they came back and they came back with this new approach where they have three different levels of the strengths of their fragrances. They have person, personal, which are lighter, um, more close to the skin. They have expressive, which is the middle, which is like what their fragrances used to be. Um, and then they have bold, I think. And so I was most interested in um, the expressive and I am very much, now I have used gold before. I I really liked it and I almost bought it, but then I didn't because it just didn't last on me. Um, but all the rest of these I have not tried before. So right now I'm only doing the one that I've been most interested in and that's milk. Um, so I'll do book, gold, velvet, moss, and paper at another video. But right now we're just gonna take a peek at uh, Commodity Milk, the middle one. So that's the expressive. So dang it, I should have prepped this a little bit better. I have a barking goddess in my lap <laughs> who is getting attention, therefore she's not barking. Okay, so, scent space express, okay, so it slides out like this. And then it appears to have a book that talks about it. Oh, neat. It comes with uh, perforated blotters that you can spray, that's super fun. But I'm going in, I'm going in all the way here, right on skin milk you know how you get a idea of what something's gonna smell like so that's the first part of the battle sometimes is if it doesn't meet what you expected it might seem like a fail right at first um, but then you end up liking it later so okay here we go here honey I don't want you to get this on your face okay oh. Okay, let's see. I like it a lot. Okay, so that's, I'm gonna put her down. We'll see if she'll stay quiet. So that's good, right off the bat, I'm loving it. I'm just trying to decide what I'm smelling, um, what I'm thinking I'm smelling. Does it talk about it specifically? Milk. Seeking comfort in the familiar, this creamy and calming scent offers the perfect start to the day. Cold milk adds a cooling element to an otherwise rich and warm fragrance of marshmallow, mahogany, and tonka bean. Okay. I'm getting all of that. Um, Marshmallow for sure. So I'm get it's sweet, sweet and woody. That's the two words that I would say right now. Just is what I'm experiencing. Sweet and woody. Definitely a marshmallowy quality to it. Um, mahogany wood. I'm sure that that'll come out more later. So cold milk accord skin musk 
So now it's getting softer. So at first it was like very, I wanna say sharp. It was sharp right at first. Sweet, sharp, and bright. It's, uh, it's softened and got like rounder in this much time. What's it been, 30, 45 seconds, a minute? And the marshmallow jumped out at me at first a lot, and now that's more part of the blend. It's really pretty. Um, I'm definitely gonna spray it all over myself and uh, wear it today, and I'll definitely be able to update and let you know how I'm liking it. But it's really, really pretty. Um, <laughs> and I will end there. Have a great day. Bye.